The high efficiency toilet program will offer the consumer a $100 bill credit on their water and sewer bill from Public Works uh, Commission. If they replace a high flush toilet, which is typically 3.5 gallons per flush, with a newer high efficiency low flush toilet, which is typically 1.6 gallons per flush or lower. Once they replace the toilet, they uh, send some information into us and we approve it, verify it, check, and then offer them the $100 bill credit on their bill. Any customer who gets their water and sewer bill from Public Works Commission qualifies for the incentive. You would not qualify if you lived in an apartment. It is available to single family residential uh, property owners only at this point in time. An HET toilet can be found at any home improvement store in the Cumberland County area or actually anywhere where there's a home improvement store. Um, or you can uh, check with your local plumbing supplier and oftentimes you can find these HET toilets online and you can order online. The WaterSense label is an assurance for the consumer that the toilet has been approved by WaterSense, which is a partnership with the Environmental Protection Agency, and it has passed a lot of testing and stringent uh, requirements so that it meets uh, water efficiency requirements. When I first got my high efficiency toilet, I, I looked in it and I thought to myself, there is no way, there's not enough water in here and I think you associate a good toilet with lots of water. And I was absolutely shocked when I started using the toilet how efficient it was. Um, the high efficiency toilets, of course, operate with less water and they work with a gravity pull, which is uh, very different from the older, uh, less efficient toilets. So when you get yours installed, don't be alarmed at the amount of water in the toilet and think to yourself that it's not going to do a good job because actually it will be more efficient than your old toilet was even though you're using half of the water that your old toilet used. An inefficient toilet can uh, be one of the biggest consumers of water in a household. If you have an average household of three people and uh, each person flushes an average of seven times a day, which is an average, a national average, uh, you can see how many times you're flushing that toilet per day. And over the course of a year, the savings can add up to well over 10,000 gallons a year in water savings in one household. An HET toilet will reduce the flushing, the gallons per flush from 3.5 to 1.6 or lower. So it actually cuts your consumption in more than half per flush. The older inefficient toilets are pretty easy to identify. Typically they're a little bit larger, they're shaped differently, and also uh, they're marked sometimes under the lid. It'll, it'll give you the number of liters that the toilet uses. Additionally, you can lift up the lid of the tank and oftentimes there is a date stamp in there. And if the date is before 1991, uh, chances are you have an older inefficient toilet. The newer high efficiency toilets are a little more streamlined. Uh, oftentimes they are marked 1.6 or lower if you happen to buy one that's a lower flush. A lot of times people ask how much does an HET cost? And uh, some people don't want to change out because they think that they are high priced. Uh, you can buy anything in any, any price range that you want, whether it be a toilet or a car, it doesn't, doesn't matter. Uh, they vary in price. There's some very good models on the market that can be anywhere from the $125 to $200, $225 range. If you're a smart shopper and a, a savvy consumer, you could get a very fine model in the $125 to $175 range. And when you consider the $100 bill credit incentive, 
uh, you're looking at a net cost out of your pocket eventually of about $75 to $100, which is, is very, very economical and very affordable. The incentive is given as a bill credit on the customer's PwC bill. Uh, PwC will not offer cash or will not issue a check. It is in the form of a bill credit on the customer's bill. Each household is allowed up to three incentives. So that translates into up to a $300 credit per single family residential home. That's quite a savings. We are asking that you allow up to 90 days for the credit to appear on your bill. PwC will conduct random audits. When the customer submits their application, uh, they sign agreeing to a random audit by Public Works Commission. So PwC will, uh, at will, at our will, conduct a random audit to assure that the high efficiency toilet has been installed. The incentive checklist can be found on the website and look at the residential tab and under residential you will see programs and under programs you will look for the word incentive and if you click on that it'll take you directly to the program. The uh, qualification pages checklist is just a reminder of things that you need to send in to make sure that your application is complete and will not cause any delays in issuing your credit. The customer must send in the original receipt. No photocopies are allowed. Uh, no estimates from a plumber will be allowed. And uh, no invoices that are due or past due will be allowed. It has to be an original paid receipt in order to qualify. It's not necessary that you use a plumber to, uh, to replace your toilet. Uh, most people feel more comfortable with a licensed plumber or plumbing contractor. If you're very good at do-it-yourself and you've done this before, uh, you might feel comfortable performing the change out yourself. However, the majority of people do contact a plumber. PwC does not endorse, promote, or guarantee uh, any particular plumber in the Cumberland County area. However, on the website for programs, there is a list, a link to licensed plumbers in Cumberland County so that if you don't know who to call, uh, it's just a handy reference for you. The customer can contact us uh, by sending us an email to customer programs and that address is customer.programs at fayepwc.com or they can give us a call at our customer service number.